Hello darlings and welcome to Old Lady Bangers. My name is Michelle and I'm here to experience hopefully some cool music. I consume a lot of media. I'm a huge movie buff. I watch a ton of TV. I'm an avid reader but for some reason I missed out on a ton of the most recent music in uh, that seems to be like in the zeitgeist. I don't experience it for some reason. I just find myself driving in my car listening to the same old music from my childhood over and over again on my phone and I think I'm missing out on some pretty cool stuff. So I'm going to dive into some music that I wouldn't normally listen to. There will probably be some hey fellow kids <laughs> vibes here but whatever. I'm uncool. It's okay. You can call me uncool for not knowing these. I don't care that I'm a dork now. It's cool. Hopefully, as my music education goes on, though, we'll have, as Kendall Roy says, uh, all bangers all the time. But it's entirely possible that I won't be into it. And if that happens, I'll share that with you guys, too. And you guys can suggest something else, maybe by that same artist or in the same vein that I might like better. Um, like I said, I'll never write off an entire artist just based on one song. So to get started, we're going to dive into the Billboard Top 100, uh, focusing on the top 10 at any given time. And I know that that's not always the best indicator of what the best music, what, what, what the newest music already always is, um, and that's okay. I definitely want to hear your suggestions, um, but I was looking through it and I didn't really know any of the songs, uh, which is so weird to me because like when I was a kid, the songs on the Billboard charts were the soundtrack to my life. Like <laughs> you knew everything on the Billboard charts. So. so let's focus on the number seven song, which right now is by Carol G and Shakira. And it's called TQG. I have no idea what that stands for. I've heard of Shakira. Uh, she's got a song about her hips, doesn't she? Like hip, hips don't lie or something. I, I think that's it. The song is in Spanish. So I've pulled up um, a video with the English translation. It's not, it's, I think it's just an English translation with the video, the official video behind it. So that I can know what they're singing about, which is always better for me. I don't know Carol G, never heard of her. I know Kenny G, <laughs> but I'm guessing that's different. So yeah, I, but, I, but I like to know the story of the song. So I'm, I'm glad I found a, a video with the English translation. Uh, so let's see what this one is all about. All right, click. La que te dijo que un vacío se llena con otra persona te miente. Es como tapar una herida con maquillaje, no se ve, pero se siente. Te fuiste diciendo que me superaste y te conseguiste nueva novia. Lo que ella no sabe es que tú todavía me estás viendo toda la historia, bebé, que fue. No, pues que muy tragadito. Estás buscando un lado si sabes que yo errores no repito. Dile a tu nueva I very much like her teal eyeshadow. Is bichota bitch? Is that what I, because I like that idea. <laughs> That's a good word, bichota. Uh, so yeah, I'm getting the gist of it. Like, I've moved on. Why aren't you moving on? Don't, you know, you're all up in my stories and my, my DMs and you're upset about like me moving on and I've moved on. What's wrong with you? So yeah, I think I'm getting the gist of it. There's some cool lines. I'm, I don't know if the translation is good or not. Um, you guys, if you speak Spanish, you guys let me know if the translation that you're seeing on it is good. But uh, yeah, no, it's it's got a cool beat. I'm liking it. I don't know that I can tell the difference. Like if I was just listening to this without watching the video, I would not know that this was two different singers. 
their voices are very, very close to each other. So yeah, I'm not sure why that is, or they're, they're, they just seem like they have the same tone, they have the same, like they're the same rhythms. Um, I could, I wish it was a little, there was a little bit more of a, of a difference in their voices. Let's get back to it here. <laughs> Uh, gotta stop again i <laughs> i like that the oh, i don't repeat mistakes and <laughs> you were one and so shoot go on because i don't repeat mistakes that's a great line also a great line i don't compete for men I don't know what that means. <laughs> yeah, no, that was cool. I thought it had a good, um, good rhythm to it. You know, definitely um, what I would expect from like a Spanish language song. I don't know a ton of Spanish music, but it's, you know, it's got that kind of Cuban um, salsa beat to it. Don't, don't at me if I get that wrong. Okay. Cause I don't know. <laughs> I live in Minnesota for God's sake. I don't know. Um, but you know, it had a good, had a good rhythm to it. And, um, you know, I definitely liked the message, like, don't come back. I don't repeat, I don't repeat mistakes. You don't, don't be looking at my, liking my Instagram photos and all, you know, stalking me on, on social media. Cause you're with her now, you know, tell her to shut up and get out of my business. Like, cause this is, this is not drama that I'm interested in. Cause we're done. Like, you know, I could absolutely get behind that. So yeah, no, that was a great song. I, you know, can I sing along to it in the car? I don't speak Spanish. So if I spoke Spanish, I probably could, um, but maybe they'll do an English version. But yeah, it'd be nice if they do a trans an English translation, but certainly wouldn't expect them to do that. So yeah, no, I thought it had a great, great vibe and a great message. I like that. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help the channel. Hit the subscribe button and to see more of my re music reactions. And if you'd like to see my movie reactions, there's a ton of them, including the entire Marvel Cinematic Universe over on my movie channel called Old Lady Reacts. There's a link downstairs for you that's so you can find it easily. Leave, please leave your comments and suggestions below. I'd love to hear from you about um, what I should be listening and reacting to. I hope you'll join me in getting out of your comfort zone when it comes to the media you consume and support. You guys are awesome. I love you, darlings. Mwah.